things God loves is the hardest thing that we will ever do in our entire lives. If it were easy, everybody would do it. But loving as God does, we'll spend a lifetime learning to do it, and we will never master it in this world because God's love is supernatural. And it takes something supernatural on the inside to even be able to love as God does. It takes a spiritual birth. 1 John 4, 7 says, Everyone that loveth, that agapes as God loves, the agape love that God has, everyone that loveth is born of God. You have to be born of God in order to have this kind of love. But when you are born of God, Romans 5, 5 says that the Spirit of God enters into you and that the love of God is shed abroad in our hearts by the Holy Ghost which is given unto us. Now sometimes people will say, yeah, but, but, but wait a minute, don't lost parents love their children? You know, don't lost husbands love their wives? Well, yeah, they do, but there's nothing supernatural about that. Even publicans and sinners love those who love them. A natural man is a man who has only experienced a natural birth. And anybody with a natural birth can have a natural kind of love. But that doesn't distinguish that person as particularly loving. Even Hitler liked people who liked him. But only a supernatural rebirth can give a person a supernatural level of love like God has. A love that enables you to love the stranger. A love that enables you to love the unlovely. The kind of love that Christ had that enabled him to love even his enemies. Is that the kind of love that you have? Would you like it to be the kind of love that you have? God offers it to you. He calls on you to repent of your lovelessness for him, to believe him today, to receive him, to let him into your heart and life, to let him love others through you. 